Hi, my name is Tony Pinker, and I coordinate and produce some of the CGI for the Mission Backup Earth project. CGI is an important part of the Mission Backup Earth project. With the live action being shot entirely on the green screen, every scene requires some CGI element. Most episodes also contain animations of varying complexity. Uh, they might be as simple as a hatch opening or closing in the background, uh, and right through to as complex as an enormous spacecraft manoeuvring through space. All of the graphic elements are created specifically for the Mission Backup Earth project. There's no stock footage used, um, there's no stock models used. It, it's all completely original for this project. The process of developing a CGI element starts with the storyboard. Alex uh, generally provides us with a series of images. He, he spends some time trawling the web, finding graphics that um, sort of indicate to us what he has in mind for a particular element and a particular spaceship or vehicle or, or set, an interior scene. And in some cases, he might provide a sketch. As you can see, the sketches are sometimes pretty rough, but they give us they give the team a lot of freedom to, to be creative and to, to sort of bring our own styles into the, into the concept. The CGI team members then basically go away and start building the models, uh, providing continual work in progress images, um, putting them up on Facebook so that the whole team can see them and comment on them. Uh, previous animations are generally done in a low resolution way so that the action can be checked by Alex before we get to, into the rendering process. A range of uh, modeling and animation software is used by the team. Um, everything from professional packages like uh, like Maya and 3D Studio Max and Carrara through to um, online tools like Blender and Animator. Once the animation process, modeling and animation process is complete, rendering starts. Um, this is obviously the, the slowest part of creating any element. It can take everything from a couple of minutes for a single background plate right through to several days for um, a more complex animation. Finally, the rendered stills and uh, frames are uploaded to a Google Drive, which is accessible by the entire team, so that the, um, when it's time for editing, the, the editors can grab it and put it all together and sprinkle their magic all over it. <laughs> With team members literally spread across the globe, uh, coordinating such a geographically diverse team is no easy task. It would have been impossible without the support of collaborative sites like Wreck a Movie, which unfortunately isn't with us anymore, and uh, Facebook. Mission Backup Earth is a rare opportunity for um, amateur CGI artists to get their work out there, um, which is often the hardest thing to do, and to have it seen by a larger audience. And it, it could provide invaluable experience to someone who wanted to get into this, into CGI production as a career path. It's been absolutely fantastic uh, working with such a talented team on a goal-driven project that's so enthusiastically supported by everyone, particularly Alex. But uh, everyone involved in the, in the, the production is 100% behind it and gives everything they can. If you're interested in joining the team, just go to missionbackupearth.com, um, send us a message and get on board. We'd love to have you.